Casorla's two one-act plays, My Trinidad and The Sea Glass Ladies Tonight, directed by Deb Blog. Uh, I just want to introduce the artists uh, on stage here. We have a Trinidadian girl of 12, an Alfred, an American tourist in his 40s. At a resort's beach in Barbados in the water of the Caribbean Sea, the surf is heard in the background. Seashells are scattered about the sea floor, including a few large ones nearby. At Rise, Roxanne and Alfred are swimming. They get closer to each other without noticing each other as they swim. Alfred treads water easily. Roxanne swims, but with greater difficulty. She goes below the surface from time to time.
Twins, 10 years old. They got light skin? Your kids? Yeah. yeah. You like them no matter their skin color, I bet, right? Sure. You're a good dad. I can tell. Well, where are they? Ah, uh, they're at the resort's pool. I don't know why, but you know, they like the pool better than the ocean. We have pools all over back home. We travel thousands of miles and they want another pool. So, but they like it. So. I bet you know a lot of stuff. I guess I do. You're real easy to talk to, you know? <laughs> Thank you. I hope you have people in your life that you can talk to. My friends are so just not mature. Well, but they're probably 12. <laughs> <laughs> and you're very advanced at 12, so. You can't expect to have friends as smart as you. Why not? You know how to sew? Uh, no. <laughs> you can help a woman have a baby. How, how do you mean? No, no, no. <laughs> Pull a baby out if you uh, have to. Uh, uh, Wrap uh, it up. Help the mother. Cut the cord. You know, all that bloody stuff. No, I'd probably faint. <laughs> you would not. Mm. You're a father and you would be strong. To show your children. You know how to make a cloth to cover the dead? No. Okay, I got one for you. You know how to add big numbers. Mm -hmm. How much are 1,542,672 plus 1,000,000 plus 1,389,526? Hmm. I can't do that in my head. I can. 5,832,198. You are amazing. <laughs> you want to know a secret? Hmm. I bet you're good at secrets. Yeah, uh, yes. Always. I like secrets. I knew that answer. <laughs> I added it up on paper and keep the numbers in my head. <laughs> <laughs> what do you do with yourself? I'm a lawyer. I work in real estate. I know about that stuff. You do? We got a big real estate up on the hill near my town. It once belonged to a plantation man, and now they made it into a fancy restaurant. No, I, I help people buy land, build buildings, that sort of thing. You think you'd find something like that? Ooh, look at that shell down there. I'll go get it. Now, hey, hold my hand. <laughs> it's beautiful, but it rocks <laughs> sinks, then comes up with the shell. Listen, why don't you uh, put that shell on the beach, or let me do it. Alfred takes the shell from Roxanne, and goes to the shore, leaves it there, and returns. Thank you. Mm. You, uh, you want to know a real secret? No jokes this time? My, my father doesn't like me. It's because I'm dark black. He's light. But my mom is dark. He don't... See why his children should be dark. He doesn't like my brother Joseph either. That's terrible. He moved out when I was three and Joseph was born. He told my mom, no kids of his is going to be black. And he just left. I'm so sorry. My daddy don't think I can be somebody. But I already do so many things. I show him. Yes, you will. I'm sure. He burns me up. But I pay him no mind. I'm going to be a real good divorce lawyer. The best in all Trinidad. This Sunday, when he's down and out, he'll come to me for a loan. Will you give it to him? No! No loan for him, never! Never! Ooh. Look at that one. Right there. That one's big and pink like a hibiscus. I can get it. I can. Now, careful, it's deeper. I show him. <coughs> Alfred swims to her, takes the shell with one hand, and supports her. Roxanne goes limp. Alfred pulls her to shore and rests her head in his lap. Alfred soothes her cheek and brow. I show him. Yes, you will. Yes, you will. The sound of surf builds as we fade to black.